Konnichiwa. My name is Kate Jory and I'm an FD Explorer. Um, I'm based in Seoul, South Korea, and I arrived here about two months ago. Um, so as an explorer in Korea, we don't really have much presence here from either FD or KX. So my job is to kind of, uh, I guess, build company presence, build a pipeline, um, build recruitment presence, build tech fund presence. Um, I think that Korea is a very interesting market to do business in and I'm very excited to have been posted here. Um, in the last two months, I've found that they've been two of the most challenging months of my life, but they've been great. Um, I'm learning heaps. Uh, so basically, on a day-to-day -day basis, um, explorers have to, I guess, explore the market, for lack of a better term. So your job is to identify companies through research. You have to research and understand the market. And then once you identify those companies as potential clients, you then have to do the research on who's in the companies. So you have to work out the right people to contact. Um, so it's not just a matter of finding the right people. You've got to find the right way to reach out to them. Um, so Korea is very network based. Uh, it's extremely in, in person, I guess you'd say. Uh, so a lot of what I have to do is build relationships in all kinds of places because you never know you can make 300 friends and it might be the 300th that will be the person that will connect you to the right person. So it's a lot of what I do is about building relationships. Uh, this isn't just for commercial value. We also have to do this for the KX Technology Fund. So we represent the fund on a day-to-day -day basis. So as well as finding, um, I guess you'd say, more established companies, we also have to find startups that may be interesting to the KX Technology Fund. Um, this is a long process because there are a lot of startups out there. So the best way to do this is to become friends with VCs and incubators in the area. Um, so building that relationship, they're able to help you identify the startups as well. Um, another area that we look at will be recruitment. So we have to befriend a lot of the universities here. Um, we're looking for bright young talent in every country, um, including Korea. So um, basically that involves reaching out to universities, departments, and introducing KX to them and getting to know them and just generally speaking building a relationship there um, and building awareness. Uh, this is all a very long process. Uh, it takes time, relationships don't just happen. Um, it's a lot of research, it's a lot of cafes, it's a lot of meetings. Um, I found this particularly great in Korea because I'm so foreign, they're interested in talking to me because I'm I guess exciting and different for them um, so that's really worked in my favor but at the same time language barrier makes life quite difficult um, and I guess you kind of find that you work out more about who you are based on when you're around a different culture and I think most of the explorers have experienced that um, so I would probably say that this program has definitely made me jump outside my comfort zone I live in Korea at the moment um, most of my meals involves dumpling, tokonasu and bimibap, so um, there's a lot of, there's different food, there's different language, there's different everything really. Um, so it's been fantastic and it's an extremely exciting opportunity and if you get a chance to do something like this, whether it be with FD or whether it be with any company, I definitely recommend that you take it. Um, just jump outside your comfort zone, try something new.